What's up everybody? It's Wick here and it's time for another haul video. Uh, I'll let you know right now I've been sick for the past two and a half weeks and I'm probably going to be coughing. I'm um, really not that sick, it's just a cough is lingering, it's still in my chest. So uh, yeah, I'll be prepared for that. Getting ready to make a shipment. I'm so far behind. It is mid-November and I don't have this shipment out. I'm missing out on fourth quarter bad. I've really dropped the ball. Um, I'm selling stuff. I mean all my inventory is selling and it's not even really that close to Christmas yet so I guess it's a good problem to have that my stuff is selling. It's just that I really should be outsourcing more and there's just all kinds of stuff been happening. But that's the way it goes sometimes. But let me jump into this um, let me start over here as I got stuff over here. Uh, these faucets were a great find at Lowe's. Uh, you see here, $27.80 is what both of them were, I believe. But when I went to pay for them, they both were like $16. So, super happy about that. I'll just combine these in. It's a, uh, pretty nice faucets, I guess. They're, um... I know after fees, oh well, I paid like 32 bucks, 32 bucks, and after fees and everything, it's going to be $200 profit when I sell both of them. So definitely a great find there. Uh, I got these. Uh, there's a lot of these. I just didn't want to buy them all because I don't want to uh, have too many of them and not sell. Uh, I paid uh, four something for these. Uh, it's basically five bucks and they sell for I forget what but I should base right now fifteen dollars that could change but I should at least be able to double my money they're outdoor uh, or timer with remote I don't know if they're outdoor or not I thought they were well if they are I was thinking well it'd be great for Christmas lights because people could remotely turn off on on and off their outdoor Christmas lights but I gotta get them shipped out to sell them yo so there's that, oh, one of the largest things I bought, this thing weighs, I believe it said 32 pounds on the box, I'm not even going to really show it to you, because it's just in the box, I cut it open to make sure it wasn't broken, I paid $75 for it, <coughs> it's a uh, power inverter, I believe, <laughs> But it has a really good rank on Amazon. It sells for five hundred and five dollars on Amazon. So I don't know if I'm going to ship it in to FBA. I probably just try to merchant fulfill it. And if I can't merchant fulfill it, then I'll ship it in. Because then I'll just take it to UPS and just ship it in the box it's in. Uh, it should cost probably like thirty dollars plus to ship it, not going through Amazon. But that's fine. Um, basically three hundred to three twenty-five. We'll just be safe and say three hundred dollars profit after fees and everything is what I'll make. So, really happy uh, to found that. Oh, here's some, a little tip for people who shop at Lowe's. Um, probably won't focus, but this says special order return. Any special order return is something they don't keep in stock and they're just gonna, they're gonna drop it to super cheap. You probably talk to a manager and they'll drop it down for you. Be like, I want this 80% uh, off, I'll buy it right now. And a lot of times they'll probably do it. Um, oh, all these um, outdoor solar lights. Some are solar, some are the wire. But this is only half of them in this box. I got spent over a hundred dollars on these lights. I got a few different kinds, and I estimate I'll make about a hundred and fifty dollars. So I'll get my hundred dollar investment back, and then make a hundred and fifty on top of that. <coughs> So that's it over there. Um, oh, I don't think I showed this. Uh, another large thing. I may have showed this already. If I did, oh well. It's a Sony uh, speaker stand, new in box. Got this at Goodwill for 13 bucks. Uh, sells for 100, 100 plus. So another thing I might merchant for fill and just ship the box because it's in there padded nicely. I just put a shipping label on it. But we'll see. Um, should make 70 bucks on that after fees. <coughs> Excuse 
excuse me. Okay, over here real quick. Not the biggest haul. I have a bunch of videos backed up. Probably like five um, <laughs> flipping junk videos I need to get out. I've really been procrastinating. So this was probably going to not even show up until like January or something. So holidays will be long gone, I bet. But these I got at Lowe's. They have a floor box assembly. Sell for 30 something. I paid 10 a piece. I'll have to check and see how much I make. I forget exactly. I'll try to go through this stuff fairly quick before I have a coughing fit. Random remote at Goodwill. Paid two bucks. I believe I'll make seven dollars on that after fees in the end. I uh, haven't been to garage sales in about three weeks, but I forgot to put this in my last. Well, there is no garage sales. That's why it's out of season. But uh, three dollars for this reel. I can eBay this for uh, like 30, 30 bucks. So I'll make uh, probably twenty dollars profit. And I only paid three dollars for it. Pretty nice. There's some other reels there I should have looked up. Paid up for this uh, TI eighty three, I believe. TI eighty three plus. Didn't notice the uh, spot in it. You see, there's kind of like a dark place. So I paid twenty five for it. Otherwise, it's in pretty good shape. I don't know how that will affect the condition, but uh, I was hoping to double my money. But I may only make like twenty dollars in the end on that. So. I'm just going to say 20 hopefully that, that black mark is not something that's going to cause me a problem. Uh, pendant filter, what did I pay for this? I don't remember. I think it was like 3 or 4 bucks. I make like uh, 20. <coughs> 20 on it in the end. I uh, went and got some stuff at Kohl's for myself and found these Ninja Turtle hats. They were on clearance for, what was it, like? Two something. Uh, yeah, 90% off. Two dollars and forty cents. I might give them as gifts. If not, I haven't really checked to see what they sell for on eBay, but I'll try to sell them for probably twenty bucks on eBay. Uh, should make. Actually, I might probably just sell them for twenty-four. I uh, should make a uh, ten or fifteen a piece on them. So I just say ten dollars profit. There's forty bucks right there in hats so pretty good uh, I got these uh, Canon Rebel batteries at Goodwill still in the package packaging is a little rough but I think I can clean it up pretty well uh, I paid five dollars a piece I know I'll make fifteen dollars each on them so it's thirty dollars profit between the two uh, this I got um, I believe I paid five dollars for it, and I think it sells for like fifty-five. These handheld games sell for a large amount for some reason. And this stupid thing. Hope the lighting's good in here. It's really dark and cloudy outside. And on my camera, it doesn't look so good right now. But it's an RCA foldable speakers. You plug them in. Super outdated. It was at a. Uh, at the consignment shop I go to in the case eight dollars I just scanned it right there and she was staring at me I'm like whatever I don't care anymore and I believe it sold for like 50 bucks <laughs> probably something that's gonna sit there forever but it should be you know it should make me like 25 bucks in the end so I went ahead and gambled on it uh, these I may have showed these in another video too I paid like was that, 30 cents a piece on these I'll make like two dollars and fifty cents each one two three four five and I have eleven more so there's sixteen of them I'll do the math have the totals in the corner um, also at the consignment shop this Kodak premium photo paper was uh which was this three dollars and it sells for 21 I think but what was it I thought I made 15 I may only make 12 I'll have to look it up again to be sure but then I walked over the same day and I found this it was said uh, $4 on it it's a Bose 
<laughs> bracket for a speaker. You know, the Bose name is amazing. I don't like Bose. I've, I found one of their products and I was using it and it's, it's really just kind of crappy in my opinion, but to each their own if they want to pay that much money for this stuff. But anyway, I figured this would be worth a lot. I couldn't scan anything because I guess I'll get service in there. I was walking by the door, still wasn't getting service, so I was like, whatever, I'm just buying this. I know, I know it's going to be worth something. So I went ahead, bought it. Uh, ended up being two dollars instead of four dollars. I guess it was a half price, uh, half price shelf. You see, there's a tag there already for thirty bucks. So, yeah, it was like thirty some dollars on Amazon. So I'm, I should make, uh, I believe it was twenty five bucks on that. So a great little find there. Uh, Tell emergency. All this little handicap uh, kind of stuff can be worth a lot. The box is heat up. I slid it open. Everything inside still new. Um, I don't know if I'll sell it new. I paid three dollars. It's on Amazon for 128. A decent rank. It's in Health and Beauty. I'm still not approved for Health and Beauty. Every now and then I find an item that's just. Uh, oh, I wish I was approved in Health and Beauty, but honestly, I haven't felt the need to even attempt it. I, I definitely should get on that. So I know there's some opportunities there. I should just go to the Health and Beauty Clearance and just buy a bunch of stuff and, and get that going. But on eBay, it's like $50 new. So I don't know what I'm going to do with that yet. Uh, I'm just going to estimate just on the safe side. We'll really lowball it and say $30 profit. But I believe that's it. Um, got a pretty big video game haul video I'm going to have to do. I don't know when that's going to hit though. Probably before this. So you've probably already seen it. <coughs> but uh, that's it everybody. 12 minutes. That's not terrible. I have no idea what the total is. I think pretty good. Thanks to that inverter. Got to get this stuff shipped out. Um, got a bunch of board games I need to get shipped out. A um, bunch of Ouija boards actually got these online not gonna try to hide that I guess Ouija boards I got at Walmart got those a few months ago got a bunch of them for uh, like five bucks a piece and I'm selling them for basically 15 basically doubling my money um, they're selling pretty good now it's getting close to Christmas but I need to get the rest of them out anyway guys uh, thanks for watching please subscribe if you enjoyed the video you can see what I'm doing to make money what I'm finding um, going into the slow season, it depresses me, but uh, we're still going to find ways to make money. This has been Wick. Till next time.